give you a brief tutorial of the two concept builders related to energy that you're going to be doing. For each of these concept builders, um, if you do only, oh, that's weird. Huh, this one just rolled off. Anyhow, if you do only the apprentice level for each one, you get five points in the, stand, the standard. In, um, if you do only the master level, you get six points in the standard. If you do both apprentice and master, um, you would get uh, eight points in the standard. And if you do only the wizard level, that's all you would need to do to get ten points in the standard. Because for both of these, I think the wizard level is significantly harder than the other two levels. Um, so anyhow, you don't have to do all three levels. If you do, remember, I'll get you some bonus. That's how that works. Um, the first one, what's up and down with PE and KE, is standard E1. The next one, which is um, match that bar chart, is standard E2. So let's take a look at these briefly, and I'll go through a little bit of examples for these. So I'll try to do a, one or two samples on the wizard level just so you can sort of see what some of the more difficult ones are. And once again, remember, you need to see your name there, your email there. That's how you know that you're logged in. All right. Read the description of the bold-faced object and decide if the kinetic energy and gravitational potential energy is increasing, decreasing, or remaining constant. The bucket of water, that's the system, is pulled upward out of the well at a constant speed. If it's at a constant speed, the kinetic energy should be constant. If it's pulled upward, the gravitational potential energy should be increasing. Let's check that answer. Data away. I'll do one more. Hey, again, reading the bold face subject, blah, blah, blah. A box of single shingles <laughs> is dropped from the roof and falls to the ground below. It doesn't say anything about air resistance or friction. In this case, we're only interested in KE and PE grab. So if it's falling, it's going to speed up. That increases kinetic energy, and the potential energy would decrease. Data away. All right, so I think we're, we've got enough with that. I'm going to go back to the main menu. Yep, return there. And then I'm going to escape from this. We're going to go back to the work and energy ones. This, so the second um, bar chart, or, or the second uh, concept builder, is the match that bar chart. I'm going to actually do one of this from the master level and then one from the wizard level because they look kind of different if I recall. So we're going to go to the master level and again it's four, four, and eight questions, five, six, eight points total, ten points if you do this one. A disk slides on a friction free surface. Use the given energy bar chart to identify the appropriate bar charts at locations A, B, and C. So this is all kinetic, no potential energy. So we would define that as our zero condition. What about this one? Well, I better have five total bars, so that doesn't even make sense. That doesn't even make sense. Uh, that doesn't make sense because I've got six total bars. That does make sense and agrees with that. I'm not sure if that's the only thing there, but again, I think, I think that's the best answer. So for this one, I should be going up and having some PE and some KE. So that seems reasonable, except I've only got four bars and there's no friction. So here I've got three KE and two PE. That seems reasonable. If I go to this one, I'm between this case where I've got all potential energy and this one where I've got only two potential energy. So I'd expect a total of five bars and either three or four units of potential energy. So this one seems like it should make sense. And that is the only one that makes sense. So I'm going to check my answer. Dad away. I'm going to go back to the main menu. I want to show you how to do one on the wizard level. So in the wizard level here, we've got a car up here. There is for the wizard level, you have to consider the effects of friction, air resistance, and collisions. So that means dissipated or internal energy. And if you're unsure what those terms are, they come up right there. Okay? So this starts with all potential energy. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 
Eh, yeah, 10 bars. So the total here should be 10 bars for all these things. So here we've got some friction. So I would expect a lot of um, kinetic energy, but a little bit dissipated. Not a lot dissipated, a little dissipated, and there should be some kinetic. So again, I don't think it's all kinetic because this says there's some friction here. Mm, I don't think it's half and half. Don't think it's that because there's no kinetic. Could be this because there's a lot of kinetic. We don't know where the zero position is, so there could be some gravitational potential. And there's some dissipated. So I'm going to think about that being 8, 1, and 1. Uh, nope, there's got to be some dissipated, so I don't think that makes sense. So I'm going to go back to this one. So now here we're up higher, so we should have more gravitational potential, so more bars of green, less bars of red, and again, because there's friction still acting, more bars of orange. So could be that. That seems a little like there should maybe be a little more potential, a little less kinetic. Could be that also. Uh, maybe we'll go with that. Uh, no, because it couldn't reach up here for still dissipating energy. So I don't think that's it. So this maybe makes sense. Two dissipated, six potential, two kinetic. I think that makes sense. So I'm going to see if there's any others that make sense. Now you wouldn't have that much kinetic up there. So this is a tough one. I think that's going to be it. I think it's going to be something like that. So here at the end, I should have some potential and a lot of dissipated. I may or may not have any kinetic anymore. Ooh, but that's kinetic. Gotta look. I've got green and orange is what I've got to look for. Uh, I don't think so. Not, not if this is the other one. I think that's it. It's the same height, so I've still got six bars of potential, but I've got more dissipated. Let's check it out. Okay, so you can see that wizard level is really tough. Uh, so you may want to end up doing something other than the wizard level there. Anyhow, that's all I've got to say for that. That's your tutorial. Hopefully that works for you.